So you're staring at the business end of a Marlin 57. It's a very old rifle. I want to protect it. And specifically, I want to protect the muzzle and the crown. Problem is, is maybe I don't have a, um, a boar snake that I can run through it in the direction of travel for the bullet. I'm going to go in the opposite direction with a, um, with a cleaning rod. How do you do it safely? That's coming up next on Mostly 22 LR. Hey everybody, Rob Rosenberger here for Mostly 22 LR. For those of you who don't have a boar snake that you'd run through your semi-automatic uh, rifle, or your semi-automatic pistol even for that point, uh, and you can't get uh, uh, your rod through in the direction of travel of the bullet, you usually are going to go in the opposite direction with your rod. So what you want to use if you go in this route is you want to use what's known as a brass muzzle protector, or in if it's a... Um, it might also be called a brass muzzle guard, and I believe this one is from uh, Gunslick, maybe, but uh, they come from different companies. They're always made out of brass, and what you do is you just simply put your cleaning rod in, and then you can use this as a guide, and it will get it in there without damaging your crown. And the crown is a very important part of the rifle. It's, a, it's actually the very last thing that touches the bullet. The crown is like the fingertips of the uh, football player as he releases the ball. So this right here lets you guide your rod in. If this accidentally hits it, it will hit it at all points on the, um, on the muzzle, at all points on the crown, and you're actually protecting your crown. So I like this uh, for no good reason on a semi-automatic because uh, I would use a boar snake. But if I were to uh, clean it with a semi-automatic, uh, cleaning it with a cleaning rod, I would use this. It's nice and old. You can see that it's got uh, plenty of use on it, but uh, it does the job, and it does the job very well. So I like this, and uh, if you're going to use a cleaning rod on a semi-automatic and you're coming in from, from the uh, muzzle, buy one of these. They're, they're pretty cheap. They're certainly less than $10, and they will certainly save you a lot of grief if you were to screw up the uh, muzzle. I'm Rob Rosenberger for Mostly 22 LR, and remember, 22 LR is real ammunition. Treat it as such.